Namaste and welcome to a reading from Ashtavakra Gita. We saw in chapter 10, Sage Ashtavakra speaks about the folly of desire no matter how elevated or subtle it may be. Then in chapter 11, Sage Ashtavakra further describes the state of desirelessness to which he points. I will be reading chapter 12 now where King Janaka replies by describing the state of timeless stillness in which he now finds himself. So chapter 12, Abiding in the Self King Janaka said, Becoming first intolerant of action, then of excessive speech, then of thought itself, I come to be here. Neither sounds nor other sense perceptions attract my attention. Even the self is unperceived. The mind is free, undistracted, one-pointed, and here I am. Effort is required to concentrate a distracted mind, superimposed with illusion. Knowing this, I remain here. Nothing to reject, nothing to accept. No joy, no sorrow. Lord, God, I am here. The four stages of life, life without stages. Meditation, renunciation, objects of mind. Nothing but distractions. I am forever here. Doing and not doing. Both arise from ignorance. I know this and I am here. Thinking of the unthinkable one, unavoidably conjures thought. I choose no thought and remain here. Blessed is he who attains this by effort. Blessed is he who is such by nature. With that, we end today's reading of Ashtavakra Gita. Chapter 12, Abiding in the Self. Thank you. Bye-bye.